I've been out fishing for a few hours now, and this uh, Chinook PFD by NRS is awesome. Um, this is the second time I've used it, and yeah, I just wanted to go through some of the features on it and all the gear I have in it. This thing just looks awesome. Looks uh, looks great when it's on you. Um, just the, the design, the fit and finish of it, it's uh, super well done. That also, I think, helps with, with catching fish, is just looking awesome. Let's take a look at the features on this uh, PFD, and then uh, we'll go ahead and look at all the gear. This thing is super comfortable. So the Chinook is the halfback. Um, they, NRS has another one that's a, that's a full back, but I like this because I'm, I'm sitting in a kayak usually, um, and so I want, I want more kind of, I don't want a, like a bunch of bulk in my lower back. Um, this webbing, this mesh is, it, it's breathable. It's super easy to adjust when you get it on you. Um, just kind of loosen up the straps, get it on, easy to pull and, uh, and tighten it. Little loop right here, which I have not used yet. And then it's got these big, straps up here really easy to just kind of loosen up when you get it on you uh, just pull these down and, until it's nice and snug zipper on it is big and beefy so really doesn't doesn't snag it's easy to kind of undo do that and it has a buckle down here pretty adjustable pretty lightweight it's got a strap up here for your, your fishing pole attachment here for a knife. I'll go through gear in a minute. It's got these little attachment points all over the place so you can attach lanyards or different kinds of gear. You've got two main pockets. This one has a pool pocket. This one has uh, two pouches on the front. Each of the big pockets have got two zippers um, with these kind of almost vinyl feeling or rubber feeling. Um, uh, attachments on the zippers so really easy to grab seems super durable all right let's look at the gear first thing I got for this was the Nico knife also by NRS which attaches to this um, knife attachment point up here um, when you have this on you it's really easy to just reach up and pull this down with one hand um, but I not so I'm gonna pull it with both hands I really don't recommend doing this because um, you could pretty easily like slice your hand if you slip. So be very, very careful if you do this. So the knife has a bottle opener on it, has a place for a lanyard. Um, they have a blunt tip and then a pointed tip. I went for the pointed tip because I'm pretty much just in still water in lakes and stuff. So. Not too much risk of, of dropping the knife and, and popping my inflatable boat. That being said, who knows, I might be updating this video later and, and eating those words. One side of it is um, blunt, the other it's got a sharp edge and a serrated edge. And it just attaches in with uh, tension on the sheath. For the tool pocket, I picked up a um, some fishing pliers by Pissifun. Um, they these are on Amazon for about 20 bucks or something. Uh, pretty highly rated. It comes with a lanyard, so I attach it to the bottom here. It's got a little sharp edge for cutting line, an area for crimping things, this uh, edge for opening up rings. Fits into this pocket here. It seems so this pocket's a little interesting because this loop has a lot of is a lot of like play in here. And so when I'm actually when if I have this on and I'm standing and I'm bending over, these will come, these will kind of ride up quite a bit. Um, I've never had them pop out, but it will, it will ride up a bit. Now, when I'm actually in my kayak and I'm seated and I'm paddling, um, I'm casting, stuff like that, no problems. These just stay, these stay seated. So maybe that's by design. At first I thought it was a little weird that it was up here, but um, yeah, maybe it's by design. It seems to be working all right. Now let's take a look at the pockets personal gear, and then maybe this has fishing gear. So in here is where I would, got another pocket in here um, where it has a loop to attach to something. Um, and so I would put in like my wallet, maybe my phone, 
um, while I'm out in the water. Insect repellent, some sunscreen, some Carmex chapstick, and a Fisher Space Pen because these things are awesome and will pretty much write in any conditions. And then on this side, boat whistle, if I ever needed it, Luxo gear. Uh, again, this was on Amazon. It's super loud. I'm not gonna demonstrate it right now. Um, it comes with a big lanyard. This one I just keep a big lighter. And then here, got some soft plastics, some rubber worms, some Senkos, some power bait, um, some hand sanitizer. And then a couple fish sticks, which I can't wait until I accidentally think these are chapstick one day. Um, and then yeah, it's got two pockets right here and some more loops if you wanted to attach some more, um, some more gear. But um, yeah, tons of uh, compartments, tons of space on here. Um, and it's, uh, it's, pretty, it's pretty convenient where everything is placed. So when it's on you, it's really easy to, to open these pockets and, and work, within this, work within this space. I went with the uh, extra small or the excess medium. So this was the smallest one they have. The next one is large and then they have an extra large. I'm 5'8", um, 180. Uh, so yeah, this fits me very well. Um, but yeah, highly recommend this thing.